What is up YouTube? Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, life, and tech. And as you guys can see, I'm currently not in my condo. I'm actually here in Dumaguete. I'm going to give a talk about vlogging at Suleiman University. And I was thinking, what vlog do I made while I'm on the road? I'm not really a travel vlogger, so I'm not much into the cinematic, visual, like, you know, stuff that you see vloggers like Daniel Marsh and Will Dasovich do. So I just thought of doing a simple vlog wherein while, while rummaging through my luggage, maybe I'll do a vlog which I've seen in the past. I've seen a channel, GQ, do a vlog wherein they ask people to do what are the top 10 things they can't live without or top 10 essentials. So that's what we'll do today. So for this vlog, I'm going to share with you what are the top 10 things or maybe close to 10 things I can't live without. Let's go. Before anything though, let me just give a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Rose Gold and Black. If you guys are looking for amazing bracelets, necklaces, rings, glasses, any kind of men's accessories, you guys have to check them out. I was able to hook you guys up with a discount, so hit the link in the description box for a 25% discount from Rose Gold and Black. Support the brands that support this vlog, guys, because it allows me to keep making content like this for you. Now, the very first item is actually here, and I wanted to say it first because it's really the most important, and if I lose it, I'll probably die. This is my wedding ring. So this is it. This is like I got it from, uh, oh shucks, I forgot where I got it. I just bought it from, <laughs> from a store together with my wife. So it's like a matching wedding ring that we have together. Uh, my wife and I have been wear married for nine years now and we've been together for what? 10 years prior to that. So we've been a couple for 19 years, guys. So this is the wedding ring. It's like a gold and silver band. There is a diamond inside and it has our wedding date, August 7. I also wear another ring. Uh, this is a ring that I was able to get from New Zealand when I was there. It is like a silver version of the one true ring from Lord of the Rings. So it kind of captures me being a geek. So, <laughs> so yeah, these, this ring, if I lose it, my wife will kill me. So it is literally an item I cannot live without. That's the first thing, my wedding ring. The second item is my smartphone. And I currently use two smartphones right now. This one is the Huawei P30 Pro. Uh, one of my favorite Android smartphones to date. It just has a really amazing camera. Takes great photos, great videos, and this is where I play NBA 2K20 on. Really fun game. I've been playing the Nets and trying out Kevin Durant uh, with Kyrie Irving, so you guys definitely have to check that out. So we have the LV case as well that I was able to get when it was on display uh, at the Huawei booth over at Greenbelt when they launched the Amber Sunrise variant of this. And of course, we have our trusty iPhone. So this is the iPhone 10s Max. Uh, you guys have been asking me what I think about the new iPhone 11 and the iPhone Pro and the iPhone Pro Max. Uh, I'm really, I, I will only probably buy it just because I want to review it for you guys. But I'm quite content and really happy already with my iPhone 10s Max. I do a lot of videos on this also. So these two items, my smartphones. I cannot live without them because I get to do so much work on these two devices. For vlogging, for business, for my corporate life, these two are just absolute essential. Number three are sneakers. And this is actually uh, the sneaker that I wore going here to Dumaguete. This is the new White Mountaineering Night Jogger. So it has the branding of White Mountaineering. It has the white reflected hits all over it. Really nice sneaker. It actually dropped together with the new Pharrell uh, set. I think it's like the one that he made for women, wherein you had solar use and NMDs and Adelet slides, hoodies and shirts. Uh, I was picking between this one or the solar U in blue, but I ended up going with this because this is just amazingly comfortable, especially when I was able to get it at half a size up. So again, that's the white mountaineering night jogger. Now, since I am here in Suleiman and we are doing like a very special talk, I wanted to bring a sneaker that I will un-DS, undead stock and wear for the first time. So this is my dead stock pair of the Nike Off-White Presto OG. So this is still dead stock, brand new. So I will be wearing this as I give my talk and I'll bring you guys along with me uh, while I do that. So I'll probably cut to some on-feet footage right now of both sneakers before we continue. Bam! Bam. 
Number four is actually inside. Uh, I cannot live without really uh, true wireless earphones. And I have a bunch and I've featured this particular one in the past. This is the Louis Vuitton Tam Horizon earpods, I think. So the sound quality on this is pretty amazing. Now, it, it doesn't have all the features like noise canceling and talk through, but it really makes up for the sound quality and the style and the overall build of this set so i love this i've been using it a lot and it worked even well while i was on the plane so that is number four number five i cannot live without my car hard shirts and i have a lot i mean take a, i just am doing overnight but i bought three car hard shirts i just find them to be really easy to wear the monocolor the design the look the quality of the cloth is just really good so i think i have like over 10 20 shirts from carhartt it's their simple pocket tee in different colors i think i have like five black shirts from carhartt so again that is number five if i'm not mistaken our pocket tee carhartt shirts number six is inside this envelope and this is a laptop so when i travel i usually carry this one with me it's the huawei matebook so i like it because it's just lightweight it looks stylish and it works pretty well especially when i do presentations so i have a lot of my presentations for my trainings and public talks and whatever in this bad boy so it has an amazing screen if you guys take a look at it i mean take a look at how bright and vibrant that screen is take a look at the keyboard it just is a very nice, lightweight, everyday laptop that I get to use. Now, I also have a MacBook Pro, but that is usually left at home. Number seven, perfume. I love spend, smell good and I love smelling nice things. So this is currently one of my favorites. It's Mont Blanc Explorer. So it's like a cheaper version of Creed Avento. So sells for a little over 5,000 for 100 ml. Has a really nice pineapple sweet note with some sort of like without the, with the smoky vibe that you get with the Aventus. So I have been using this a lot. I think I'm about to run out, so I'll probably get another bottle of this one. Again, I love perfume. Currently one of my, the, my favorite ones. This is Mont Blanc Explorer. Number eight, of course, since I use my phones a lot, we need a power bank. So this is my current power bank, which is the Huawei Supercharge. So this is able to do uh, supercharging for Huawei devices. So it goes really well with my Huawei P30 Pro, but it can also charge iPhones pretty fast. So that's the reason why I love using this one. I have a backup one, which is the Xiaomi Mi Power 3 Pro, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, that's number eight, I think on our list. Are we on number eight? Can't remember. So let's just say it's number eight, the Mi Power Bank, I know the, Mi Power, the Huawei Supercharged Power Bank. Number nine is our iPad. So this is my iPad Pro 12 inch. So I actually use this a lot also for video editing if I'm on the go and I need to edit videos on iMovie. So this is the iPad that I bought. And I also write a lot with it with the Apple Pencil and I even do presentations. I'm also writing a book on this iPad. So the ROI on this is pretty insane, especially if I can get that book out and a lot of the other stuff that I want to have uh, made out of this device. So yeah, we have the Apple iPad. Number 10 is inside my phone. It's the Bible app. So I usually used to carry like a physical Bible with me all the time. Uh, but now I just usually read from my phone. So it's important to have a Bible, guys, because of course, that's the best way for you to find out what God's want to tell you if you read His Word. It's alive. It's always fresh. It always says new things to you depending on where you are in life. So I highly recommend that you pray, open the Bible every now and then, and read. So that's the last item on the top 10 things that I, Carlo Ople, cannot live without. Now at this point in the vlog, I'll just probably bring you guys along with me as we go through the rest of the day. I'll be going to Suleiman University with Will Dasovich, Daniel Mars, Jaco De Leon, David Gison. So yeah, just come along with me. Let's go. What's up, what's up, how's it going? Do the one and one vlogger. Even in addition. What's up, guys? What's up? We have bouncers. <laughs> Damn, That's so cool. They're massive. Yeah, we have massive bouncers. Shout out to Suleiman University and my Jared friends. Jared Perez. 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 Jared Per